Today's goal is to build a camp table with self-clamping legs. I never made this before, so let's try out if this works. Hello YouTube, welcome to another Swiss Army Knife project video. In the last episode I made a chair and today I will make a table for this chair. The only tools I need for this project is my Victorinox Venture Pro with the toolkit and the 20mm flat drill and the Swiss Army knife. And because I will use 10cm locks for this table, I need a bigger saw. This is my Falco 600. Now I would say, let's start to collect the materials. So these are the materials I collected for this project. These three locks I will split lengthways, then I turn the splitting surface upside that I get a big flat table surface. I'm not sure if I need six halves, maybe four halves are enough, but we will see. These two locks, uh, from these two locks I will make the legs. I will also then split lengthways. And these are the crossbars here. I'm not sure if these crossbars are stable enough or if I need Zico ones. But the first step I'm gonna do is to make some wedges to split these logs. So, these are the halves. I split it three locks for the table surface and I split it two locks for the table legs. I choose birch for this project because I don't know another wood sort with as less growing rotation, growing twist as birch. But as you can see, still have a little bit twist. So next step is to even out surface of these halves a little bit so that I get 
uh, the table surface as even as possible. So the next step is to bring all ends of the halves for the table surface, the last 10, 10 centimeters, the same thickness. And for that I made, I made such a template. And now I can draw in the thickness I want. And for that I use the ballpoint pen from the carrying system of the Venture Pro. So these are the four halves for the legs. Now I have to drill two holes in each leg where I can put in these crossbars. And uh, between these crossbars I can clamp after the halves for the table, like this. So. And now I would say I make the first hole in the same position on every leg, like this. And then I try to figure out the position for the second hole. So next step is to bring the diameter of these crossbars to this diameter of the holes. In this case it's 20 millimeters. So this is the leg, this is the crossbar. Now I take the half of the table and put it here, something like this. So and now I can find out where I have to make the second hole here. So 
this was a hard piece of work to make these eight holes. I needed about an hour with this flat drill. Problem was that uh, the wood was too soft, that the screw on the tip of the flat drill had enough grip to pull in the drill. The solution could be take a harder wood or take a smaller drill. Now I mark the boards so that I'm able to put them always together in the same order. So my friends, the table is done and uh, I'm super happy with the result. This table is perfect. The only tools I needed for this table was the Victorinox Venture Pro, a Swiss Army knife and the flat drill. And for the big diameters, for the big locks, I took a Falco 600. Okay, it's not super stable, but hey, for a camp table, it's stable enough and you have so much place and <laughs> I guess this is the best camp table I ever ever made. So my friends, thanks a lot for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and see you next Friday. Ciao!